Um, yeah, this next one is a, a lot, a bit of an older poem, and uh, it's kind of got a title, but it's a bit weird because the title just runs into the poem, so it kind of feels like it doesn't. The river breaks and floods the tracks. I jump into its flow and I'm at Latchmere. Inside a snake, I swim into the darkness, the spine of my back slipping down the stream, strengthening as I begin to breaststroke and I can see the light. I can see the light. My legs kick into a mermaid's tail. I reach the shore of my dreams where waves lap over me like a comfort blanket and seashells speak to me. After years of swimming, I'll find the brick at the bottom of the ocean. If I save just one from drowning, my life can be complete. I just need enough bricks to build something solid. But you know, there will always be holes that sometimes you just have to jump into that space where the key used to be, where you used to shrink down to the size of a mushroom, drink up that cherry tart, custard, pineapple. Oh, I wish I hadn't cried so much, but no, no regrets, no regrets, and no more safe bets. It wasn't too long ago that I could taste that cherry tart, custard, pineapple. Remember when we danced all night, the stage invasions, where our smiles seemed endless to be elevated so high, not quite Kilimanjaro, you know, that was never really on my bucket list, but these few days, it was like we were on an island. Every sweaty, welly step was a leap we hadn't taken before, and this year we may not reach the moon, but we're made of stardust, and you can't just make that stuff up.